Jimbo, I do protest. I never injured thee, but love thee better than thou can divide. Thou wretched boy, I am for you. Oh, I am slain. It's basically three guys that just want to do all of Shakespeare's shows in an hour and a half to two hours, and they have no idea what they're doing, and they don't even know some of Shakespeare's shows. Now, a fellow loves Jesse like a goddess loves Venus, and Jesse loved a fellow because he had a big sword. You know, Ryan or Dan would tell you that this show is about Shakespeare or complete works, but really it's just about three dudes coming together, mocking a Western icon. And what can be more precious than that? Titus Andronicus, which we will now present as an upscale cooking show. My, my character, uh, Daniel, which is actually my name, which worked out very well, he kind of keeps things moving. Okay, uh, the other characters like to go off on tangents because they're very, they're very anal about details and parts and I just want to make sure that we get done at a, at a, at a reasonable time. So See you, Jimmy! And know that Macduff was from his mother's womb untimely. What do you think about that? It is absolutely a show you should come and see. Uh, we explain some of the plots of some of the shows and other shows we just make fun of. You don't have to understand Shakespeare to understand the jokes. Um, there's a lot of slapstick comedy uh, similar to the Three Stooges, uh, very Mel Brooks comedy, Monty Python. All the world's a stage and all the men and women merely players. They have their exits and entrances and one man in his time plays many parts. How many parts exactly must one man play? Um, so I am the only one on the show with a beard, so we thought it'd be funny if I played all the women. Uh, so I'll be playing Juliet and Ophelia, um, Cleopatra, and uh, so I get to have a lot of fun with those things. And um, I get to play Macduff. I get a lot, of, a lot of different parts. I think we each play something like 15 or 16 roles. You know, I would say that the community of people here there is just so much explosive talent in this tiny little town and the surrounding communities that you would not expect to be in such a tiny community. Oh, no, no, no. Shakespeare didn't plagiarize, he distilled. Whatever, he's a big old cheater. You should come see this because you will laugh. You should come see this show because it is literally the most hilarious thing you will ever watch in your life. And uh, last night, uh, some of the people that were leaving said they haven't last, laughed this much in years, and they laughed so hard their cheeks actually hurt. Thank you, PDACT. Good night.